I left Santa Fe because of health. No money. Nobody. Pitched north. Worked on farms. Learned how to trim. Had to bail after some speakers. What are you doing? Uh, the usual. Carving some wood. You're like a walking Swiss yeah, army knife. Who taught you? I learned wood carving with an Inuit native back when I lived in Alaska. It's an antique technique. Helps me vent out and focus. Yeah, I just let my hands sculpt the wood and sometimes I have good surprises. <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. It's actually a cool cowboy thing I've been trying to do for a while, but I, I suck at this. It's just fun to relax. I can tell. Don't let me stop you, cowboy. <laughs> Later. Finn is too punk rock to be a farmer. Let's keep that souvenir from the master sculptor. Hey. Hola. <laughs> ¿Qué hay esta, señor? <laughs> Bien, ¿y tú? Tengo la púa que perdiste. Uh... No comprendo. <laughs> Don't laugh. Still learning, Professor. I said I got the pick you left at Beaver Creek. What? That's so cool. Why didn't you tell me? I didn't want to look like a creep. You don't. I lose them all the time. You can keep it, stalker. <laughs> Talk later. Damn, Sean. Can you try and be less shy sometimes? I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Boo! <laughs> Man, you are so focused when you draw. That's cute. Yeah, um... Thanks? <laughs> Let me be the judge. Whoa, whoa, give it back, please, Cassidy. Do not even look. Whoa, down boy. Really, Sean? I didn't mean to freak. Stop this tortured artist shit. Share it. Come on. Fuck. You're good. Wow. <laughs> I look happy. Like I belong here. I love how you see me, Sean. I think I look cooler as a sketch. Really? You think it's okay? <laughs> no, I'm just being nice. If it was bad, you would know. I don't lie. Well, I could never draw like that. What's your secret? I don't know. I just get inspired by the things I see and do. And uh, being around people like you helps a lot. So, I'm um, like your muse. Sweet. <laughs> well, uh, you're a great model. Yeah. Oh, don't make me blush. We all learn from each other, right? That's why I love my life right now. Finally. <laughs> yeah, but we don't always have to suck up to fuckers like Meryl. Most of the year, it's just us. The road and us. What do you miss about your old life? Anything? Besides some friends? Nothing. Well, my own bathroom. <laughs> Out here, you say that you don't need all that bullshit they sell. Huh. That's freedom. 
I mean, the trick in this country is just to survive. I guess. I do like traveling around, but I want a base. Will you ever go back to Texas? No fucking way. My daddy was a meth head who beat the shit out of my boyfriend. Just because he wasn't wet. Yep. Then my big brother told me he would shoot me if I dated. Dated that, well, you know. My mom didn't say squat, as usual. Thanks, Mom. So, fuck them all. This is my family now. Damn, I'm sorry, Cassidy. <laughs> ah, don't be. I feel sorry for them. So, tell me. What do you miss about your old life? <laughs> well, apart from my dad, I'd say Lila. Definitely. She was like my best friend. I miss our talks. I'm sure she's very special. Even when I had a shitty day, she would always make me laugh. Always. Feels like years since we talked. Probably never again. But things change. Right? Yep. So keep moving forward. You have a good heart, Sean. I think you could use some alone time. See you later. <laughs> Not everybody has time to fucking recycle or compost their shit. Especially when you live off the grid. We all should try. It's everybody's planet too. Sweden is not perfect. But we try to be more eco-conscious. We only have one planet. Not for long. It's true. We gotta do something. That's what we're saying. Blah fucking blah. Taurus talking shit again. Like you guys have it so hard. We did not say that we did. Tell me again how many hours you spent on a plane during your awesome trip around the world, and then you come crying about hobos spreading garbage in the forest? Good point. Now you're here sponging off us trash on an illegal pot farm with a tourist visa lecturing us. Funny, right? Hannah, I'm sorry. We were not trying to lecture you. We are grateful we found that job, and that you let us stay in the camp with you guys. I know. We're cool. Do you hate us now? You're funny. Don't worry. You'd know if I hated you. All I care about is my family right here. These three gutter punks. The rest? None of my business. Not used to peeling potatoes, huh? A lot of work. I know how to cook. Just not everything. Yet. Yeah, but you hate it. You want a pizza, watch TV, I can tell. Like those kids who come through here all psyched, and they have to bust ass, and they're gone. I know I have a lot to learn. I mean, you've been doing this for years, right? Pretty much. Ten years or so. I know, I know. We all got scars of our own. I just fucking hate phonies. Too many here. Crusty backpack doesn't make you one of us. Well, what do I gotta do to pass initiation? Don't be a pussy. Stand up for us. You can't be part of our family unless you open up. This is a family too, not a pit stop. Out in the wild, sharing is caring. I know just hard to start all over. It's like rewiring my brain. Everything's different. Yes, it is. Been there. Long time ago. So, how did you hook up with the others? Met Finn at some squat when he got out of jail. Young punk, but old soul. We just clicked. Then we ran into Cassidy a year ago, pissed at everything. Her, unable to commit to anything, except us. Then Pennywise found us, here in Humboldt, 
tripping about his friend Jinx. But, you know, he just fit in. Now we're all pretty fucking tight. Hell yeah, you are. It's awesome. You don't have to tell me, but how did you end up on the road? My community was a mess. Too much wasted talent. My mom, she was an artist and a drunk. Tried to get her into rehab countless times. Worked my ass off to buy her paint and stuff. Until I realized she was just returning everything to Z-Mart to get the cash back to buy her booze. I just knew I had to get the fuck out before that curse would get me too. I'm glad you're at peace now. So, are you satisfied with your life now? I'm grateful for what I have, yeah. Not everything is perfect, but we got balance, prospects. That's way more than I had before. Thanks for taking the time to talk, Hannah. That's cool. Yeah. Anyway, didn't mean to grill you, Sean. It was a long day. Whoa. Hannah's tough to figure out. Don't fuck with her. Almost done. Need two more hands, Dishmaster? Uh, yeah. That'd be cool. I'm on it. So boring. <laughs> yeah. I don't miss doing the dishes. Then why are we doing this? That's it. Finally. Need a hand with your own chores? That'd be awesome. I need help moving the water tanks to the shower and kitchen. Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Oh yeah. I can do better with my own skills now. Next level. Onward. Ready to rumble? Fucking A. Let's start with our team how. T.S. Lobos. We still sound okay. Now, let's do this. Come on. Hold up. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. Might make for a cool souvenir. Finn said he wants to show me this little cave or something. It's by the other side of the lake. Sounds cool. Count me in. The other side of that log looked secluded enough to be out of sight. The other side of that log looked secluded enough to be out of sight. Hey, can you move that tree trunk? Duh. Come on. I wasn't gonna drop it on you. Very funny, man.
Okay, let's have some fun. Bet it's different here in the summer. Penny said it gets crazy crowded. People everywhere. Yeah, that's why we can train out here now. Hmm, let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Dude, I'll blow the shit out of that. I'm waiting. Or maybe you... What the? <laughs> Aw, that's not hard. Uh, think you can lift all those? I know I can. Whoa, Daniel, that's a, that's amazing. Come on, find something else. Pick a rock, any rock. Okay, and? Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Awesome! Okay, you're good. Now, let's spice things up a bit. Bring it on. Holy shit! That was not a fair fight. That's right. What's next? That was some next level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been... Training on my own sometimes. I know I haven't been around a lot lately. You didn't tell anyone, did you? No way! Why would I? Not even Finn? No! Jeez! You don't even trust me! Whatever. You better chill the fuck out, Daniel. I mean it. Why are you making a drama out of everything I say? Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people? You're always with them! That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. Bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. You know it's always you and me and I know. I mean, never mind. That's it, enough. You're being a brat. You can't say anything without you having a shit fit. We're family. We still have a long way to go, and we have to go together, right? I know it sucks, but you have to grow up now. Stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No!
I got serious munchies. Any chips left? Dude, you scarfed the whole fucking bag. Have another hit. Yeah, yeah. I packed a fat bow. You're getting tired, babe. Du känner mig. Det är lång deftalegdags. You see that shit? It's a fucking UFO. I'm serious, man. Look. They're finally coming to take you back. Tripped on a few words, but y'all are baked, so I'm good. <laughs> good job, sis. So beautiful. Damn. Why you ain't rich and famous? <laughs> I mean, you can hook us up. I love your voice. Meow. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I take ass, cash, or grass. <laughs> <clears throat> Hint, hint. John, take a puff and pass it to your friend. Um, sure. I'll take a hit. Daniel, no fucking way. How come you can, but I can't? Because I said so. That is all for us. We must sleep. Ah, there go the party animals. What is it, like 10 o'clock? No worry, Finn. We'll party like rock stars tomorrow for our last night. Come on, one more round. Go now. Sleep tight. Jeez, I swear every time you play that song, Cass, I see my poor black flag. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Who's Black Flag? It was my dog back in Colorado until last year. Yeah, something like that. A year ago, we were hopping a train, just me, Finn, and Cass, and Black Flag. We got caught stealing some shit in some random town. Motherfuckers called the cops on us. I had to run for it. We saw that train from afar and mm. went straight at it. Mm. Cops right behind us. We barely made it. But nobody's able to get Black Flag. Jesus. Yeah, I see him chasing after the train, yapping at me. But I left him there. That's it. End of story. I hope the cops picked him up. Got him a better home. I think about that damn dog every day. Here's to Black Flag. That sucks, Hannah. We lost a dog, too. Little Mushroom. It's hard, but shit. That's life. So you gotta walk on. Jeez. Sorry, I ruined the mood. Don't worry, Hans. We can do worse. Let's hear everybody's worst memory. Fair and square. Are you serious? Why the fuck not? We all need to say our piece once in a while. Who's up? Penny? Cool. Bust out the violins. Check this out. Hi. Say hello to my little friend, Jinx. Met him dumpster diving in New Mexico. It was cool. The boy had issues. Mood swings, delirious, self-harm, fun shit like that. He seemed to get better with me. I think I loved him. He gave me this coin. Said he never gave his trust in no one before. We used to come here every now and then, hook up on cash, but he disappeared. A few miles north from here, in a pot farm just like this one. He went out one night, high as fuck, and zoom. 
That was the last time I saw him. Now I gotta hold on to this fucking penny just in case. Is that how you got your name? Yep. Whoa. He must be in law to you. That sucks, brother. Shit like that happens around here. Plus, the guy needed medication. Sure did. I just hope he's okay. Maybe I'll run into his crazy ass someday. Who knows? It's a small world. I'll hand him back the trust that he gave me. All right. Bad vibes indeed. Can we do worse? Uh, Jake? Please? Well, just don't laugh. I guess my worst memory is when I lost my faith. Yeah, you mentioned it. What happened? I used to be a sheep. A true mm. believer. I was raised in Haven Point, Nevada. It's a small community. We have this amazing reverend. People line up to listen to her. She's intense. But for some reason, things happened to me, and I started doubting myself. It kind of escalated. People said I was trouble. I couldn't get the answers I was looking for. Even from my own folks. I know the feeling. I felt so lost. I wasn't sure what to believe anymore. So I left. I just needed to be alone for a while, you know? Find the truth by myself. I'm still looking for it. Jacob, my son. Maybe we are the truth you were looking for. I'm glad I found you guys. I don't know if I'll ever go back there. Not until I get a signal from God, at least. I hope you can. Right, your family misses you a lot. I miss them too. Just not the other stuff. Family ties are a mess. Trust me. I know how that feels to be rejected. Thank you, Sean. What about you, Cassidy? Your turn. Uh, uh-uh. Pass. I already sang a song. <laughs> Figures. What about you, Sean? You obviously don't have to talk about that shit show back in Seattle. But if you have something else, Whoa, no. No way, man. I'm too wasted. How about me? You're the man I was waiting for. It's not only one bad memory, but they're all about my friends. I feel like I've let everyone down. Like Noah and Lila from Seattle. And there's our dog, Mushroom, who was killed by a puma, so we had to bury her. Then, I lost Chris, because we had to run away. Again. I know he's not my friend anymore, because I lied to him. But more than anything, I miss my best friend, my dad. Jesus, little man. That's hard. I'm so sorry, Daniel. I told you, I'd win. You didn't let anybody down. Life did. Yeah, life is a bitch. We can only go with the flow, like a river. Yeah, that's why I'm not dragging around any bad memories. <laughs> Come on. Bull fucking Oh, you shit, started this man. shit, bitch. Don't punk out now. Uh -huh. yeah, listen, smart asses. I'm just saying you can't change the past. So you just got to focus on what's next. Memories are just lessons for the future. The future, huh? What's your big plan, Prophet? Want to know what my plan is? Picture this. A kick-ass beach house in Costa Rica. Sunshine, feet in the sand, sweet ocean view. We'd be one big, fucked up, happy, dysfunctional family. We just chill and 
and sing and drink cocktails out of coconuts. Only thing we need is a little cash along the way. And then, boom. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That's your dream? Beach house and coconuts? <laughs> oh, uh, too boring for you? This sounds like my folks' retirement plan to Florida. I don't need anything else than what we already have. Sure, we're working our asses right now, but we can beat it if we want. I'm not gonna settle down. No way. That's how shit starts, you know? When you start having things of your own, things you ought to defend, property, land, family. What do you think you're missing out on now? Um, coconut cocktails? Well, agree to disagree, fucker. Man, I'm too high for your shit. It's time to crash. And Penny goes down. Peace out, brother. Night, night. Looks like we still have some booze left. Who's in? <laughs> oh, twist my arm. A teeny tiny drink. And we need to talk about Sean's hippie hair. Boy needs a real haircut. Oh, hell yes he does. <laughs> now it's your turn to get a trim. Karma. I'll call it a day too. Night, everyone. Hey, I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? No, man. Uh, I'm gonna hang for a bit. Do you want me to walk back alone? Oh. So now you're a kid again? <sighs> Have no fear. Finn is here. I'll walk you, little man. Sleep tight, Daniel. <laughs> Sweet dreams, sweetie. Now, you belong to us, Diaz. So, let's do something about that shaggy hair. Yeah, let's not. I... Like my shag. Sean, maybe you haven't noticed, but we have standards here. Fine. Whatever. Cut me up. Atta boy. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I don't want to end up with a mullet. Or worse. Tell that to your stylist. Don't look at me, boy. I only cut weed. Um, that means... Why, hello, laddie! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to McNam Hair Salon. Check, please. Yeah? <laughs> uh, step right up! Uh, hey, hey, no stress. You're talking to a pro. Just relax and enjoy the buzz. Right. Now, let's see. Hey, hands off now. Whoa, 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 down, Finn. Watch hey, out. what are you doing? Stop. I said, don't worry. Cassidy, stop <laughs> fooling around. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Stand fucking straight. Nice. Looking good, Slick. Seriously. Hey, we don't fuck around at McNam Hair Salon. Mmm. <laughs> bit more here. Yes, that's gone. Almost done. Voila! What's the verdict? Hot. <laughs> nice. Okay. Can I see now? Damn. Is that me? So... different. It's... cool. I like it. Thanks, Finn. My pleasure. Really. Careful, Sean. People are gonna think you're one of us. <laughs> don't think so, Cass. <laughs> Looks don't mean nothing. Lucky for you. Here, you deserve it. I don't know. I'm already kinda trashed. Plus, I might be hosting tonight. Uh, Finn? I don't know. Maybe. Well, just in case. 
Can y'all let me get some rest tonight? <laughs> Sean won't be able to sleep either. I'm cool. So, how long have you two been, um, together? If you don't mind. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's so funny? Q? That look on your face? Hilarious. Yeah, uh, Hans and I aren't together, sweetheart. We're just fuck buddies. Oh, oh. We're pretty open right. here. Duh. Fuck who you want to fuck. The end. Or don't. Nobody has to do anything if they're not into it. Yeah. We're not into the whole fucked up system. We make our own rules. You feel us, Sean? Or do we sound like depraved punks to you? No, oh, uh, I totally hear you. I never thought about all this. Until I met this crazy cool guy on the road. People should do what they want. Long as they don't bother anybody. That's it, laddie. Now you know why we're out here. We can be our true selves. Nobody's telling me whose dick to suck. That's fucking freedom. Right. Does it mean you're into guys and all? Uh, that depends on the position. <laughs> but, yeah, sure. Take a number, Sean. So, what about you? I'm just more into girls. Like Jen. Back in Seattle. She was so hot, man. Uh, so long. Oh, shit. You had a Jen? Ugh. There goes my chance. Sorry, bro, but you never stood a chance. Oh, s stop ruining everything. Okay, lovebirds, that's it for me. Lot of work tomorrow. Plus, it's payday. Fuck. I could talk all night, but yeah. Don't want Daniel to start whining. Gracias por todo. See ya, my dudes. You gonna swing by, Finn? Nah, sweetie. No energy. No big deal. Get some rest. Buenas noches, Sean. Loving on the hair. Meow.
Okay. This is boring. So, everybody, tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family, or... Or some hookers, or cocaine? Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I want to buy a bacon burger and a pepperoni pizza. Then, a box of Choco Chris and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. S screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Chris. <laughs> Come on, Sean. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work. <sighs> okay, that's silly. But... I really do need another pair of socks. I wash mine overnight, but they're not always dry the next morning. <laughs> He's got cold feet. <laughs> so that's it, huh? You bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah, like your beach house in Costa Rica? Okay, let's get this over with. Finn, Cassidy, Sean, and, uh, you. Jake. Jake, Jacob. Daniel, dude, do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know, but we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes and don't do anything. Nothing. I won't. I swear. Okay, we'll be right back. Ugh. For once you're all on time, let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. <sighs> Bet he did. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Meryl. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Good work, kid. Finn, you saved the pots in the greenhouse. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <clears throat> yeah. Sorry. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Get in here, you little asshole! What the fuck? Don't touch me, jerk! Don't move! Now explain! That sneaky fucker! He was snooping around your living room! No, I wasn't! I was just bored, so I came in! Uh, shut up, Daniel! Seriously! Let Shh. him go! I told you. Come on, Meryl! He's a kid, not a thief! You wanna frisk him? <sighs> Look at him! He's just following his big brother! Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Uh, oh, fuck that. Boss, no way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean, you and your brother are, are fired. What? And don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's bullshit, man. Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir, quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way, now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph, 
Just teach him a lesson. man. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it? It's mine. <gasps> Ow! What? <clears throat> okay. Okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh, I did. My fault. Uh, look! 